Well, Jürgen, we're here because you have an important message to deliver to our supporters. Ah, uh, yeah, I have to. Um, I will leave the club at the end of the season. A shock for a lot of people in this moment when you hear it the first time and... Um... Ah, okay guys. Well, today we have some interesting news because Klopp is leaving Liverpool. And, I mean, I think we all know this was eventually going to happen. And I'm convinced it's the one I have to take. Um, it is that I'm... What can I say to them? Running out of energy, the respect grew for you, the love grew for you, and the least thing I owe you is the truth. And Nunes got so angry that Klopp was leaving, he even hit an OnlyFans model. Xavi has also decided to leave Barcelona as well. And Rashford has gone rogue and forgets that he's a part of Man United. But of course, we have some other big news, including speed, so make sure not to go anywhere. So first, let's start off with the saddest news is that Klopp is leaving Liverpool at the end of this season. It's been nine years since Klopp actually started at Liverpool in 2015. So really, the real question is, what did Klopp win for Liverpool? So we got a Champions League, FIFA Club World Cup, FA Cup and League Cup, UEFA Super Cup, and FA Community Shield, which he finally won Liverpool a Premier League, which they haven't done in 30 years. And honestly, when you watch the full interview, you really see how hard it was for Klopp to leave. I still take this decision, probably will, or shows you that I'm convinced it's the one I have to take. Um, it is that I'm... Running out of energy. And Liverpool fans felt so much for Klopp, they ended up doing this for Klopp the next game. Which this is definitely better for Klopp to leave than him getting sacked. So before we move on, let's quickly look at what Pep felt about their rivalry. And Dennis is leaving part of us, and Man City is leaving too. Uh, have been our biggest rival, uh, Liverpool in these years. Uh, personally in Dortmund and he have been my biggest rival. So I think we'll be missed. But what are your thoughts on Klopp leaving? Please leave it down below. So while we're talking about managers leaving, Xavi has decided to do the exact same thing, but for Barcelona. With saying himself... Eh, M'agradaria eh, anunciar doncs, que, que el 30 de juny no seguiré com a entrenador del Barça. És una decisió... And honestly, this came to a shock to many fans. Due to the fact of Barcelona winning the league last season and a Super Copa. But due to too many disappointing performances this season, he's decided himself that it's literally going to end this season. Which pretty much came to a massive shock to everyone because he decided to leave after just two years. But moving on, let's go to the African nations because some massive teams have been knocked out. Nigeria making to the next round was just no surprise at all. But Egypt had knocked out going to penalties and they just lost on penalties. The hosting country survived a massive game against Senegal. And the absolute beast of a team South Africa beat Morocco which surprised everyone. So honestly from the round of 16s I did not expect so many teams get knocked out so quickly. So many favorite teams of course. Now this man has called out the haters and is absolutely fed up. Before I explain quickly take a look. Treinei de hoje finalizado. Acima do peso, beleza. Mais gordo. <laughs> so Neymar has basically called out his haters by this video. And here is the translation. Overweight, okay, but big, I don't think so, so ship me the haters. So the real question is, is Neymar actually fat or not? But here is some news that could actually see Rashford be the next Sancho. Because Rashford is absolutely out of control, having no respect for Tang Ha. So here's what happened first. Rashford basically told the team he was unwell for the weekend, he was unfit to even travel for the weekend. But after telling the team this, he had a blast in Belfast two nights before a game. 
and this night ended up being the biggest night of his life. Well, because it cost him 650,000 pounds for that night. Because Manchester United fined him 650 pounds. Well, really, was that one night for Rashford worth it? Well, you gotta ask him. And before we end the video, the last dance went absolutely terribly. First of all, Messi didn't even start and Ronaldo didn't even play. I show speed somehow got on the pitch and started dabbing up all the players. Yeah, what's good? What's good, man? What's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? How you doing? And Inter Miami lost 6-0. And fans were saying, imagine if Messi started because I show speed could have finally met Messi. So apart from that, guys, I'll see you in the next one.